Tail. I'm Ernie. I'm with my friend Pat. And today we got a super cool, uh, it's more of a legend adventure. It's a legend. I've been chasing for years. And uh, where we are right now is we are in West Sea Shelf. We're by Wormy Lake. And uh, right above us is where the forest fire was from a few years ago. We're just below where the, for where the fire stopped. And what we've been doing is we have found all these natural little caves that are, you find them every few hundred uh, or thousand feet as you go down the mountainside here, we've been finding these random little caves. Uh, so what's inter interesting about these caves is, uh, I had heard that in uh, 1916 to about 1918, a felon by the name of Draft Dodger Dan hid out in these forests had a cabin up in here and would sort of hide in all these natural caves and whatnot. Uh, and what was also said at the time there was no newspaper, it was quite a you know a homestead area of not many people here, but it was said that once in a while uh, some of the locals would notice that maybe some of their silverware was missing or some of their food or chickens went missing. And it was always suspected that it was this uh, draft dodger down that lived on the side of the mountain here. Uh, so we, about a month ago, found, because of this fire up there, up above us, we were able to find some of these caves. And about two weeks ago, we were exploring one of these caves, and I don't have it with me, but we found like a bayonet, like an old bayonet looking thing you'd put on the end of a rifle. So we've been working our way down. Um, we've gotten to the spot now where there is no fire. And we're going to snoop around here today and hopefully uh, we'll, we'll find uh, some more uh, signs of them or where his camp was or, or some history about them. But it's super interesting anyhow. Even these caves are pretty cool to go into. Some of them are a little scary. But anyhow, it's going to, have, it's going to be a fun day. So let's go. I'm excited. Hey, I got your camera. I'm filming now. Okay, hey, cool. Um... I'm I still digging. I got that big. I got that big charger down here. I'm still digging it. Um, anyhow, I think we're getting close. I got to check again. Make sure I'm in the right direction. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Something there. Ugh. Okay, hold on. Oh, cool, dude. I found it like a tin box or we're gonna bring it up. Ugh. Fucking cool, man. Unreal, it's got a padlock on it. Can you see it? Unreal. What kind of uh, cool. What kind of key does it take? Does that key from the other site? Do you think it fits? I don't know. Here, I'm gonna hook this up. Watch out, please. Yeah, you got that key, right? Yep. Here, I'm gonna hook this up. Or, um, sounds like something's in. I'm gonna not throw it. Can I just around for a second longer? I'm gonna get out of here. Or actually, you know what? I'm coming up. I want to know what's in there. Or I want to try that key anyhow. I'll be up in a sec. Oh, oh boy, <laughs> what a struggle. But what, look at this uh, box, man. This is so cool. And again, like I, you never would have found that. If you don't have a metal detector, you'd never find that stuff. But there it was. It was just, I can still see the daylight there where it was. So, any, uh, let's, let's try that key, man. Let's see if I can get this thing to open. Oh. Got like a cover on it. Just give it a couple little taps and see what happens. Oh yeah, it looks like brass. Is that ever cool? Just the lock is cool. There's stuff in there, man. This looks like the key, dude. Or well, let's see. Oh, no. Turns. Hold on a sec. Just 
It's like it just keeps turning. Oh, oh. it opened. <laughs> it's the right key. I don't know. You ready? Huh. Weird. Another silver cup, some bottles. Yeah, it's like weird. It looks like the other part of that um, tea, set that thing. tea set thing. And like, those are like those glass balls from Japan or whatever. What are, uh, this guy's booze bottle? <laughs> I guess he had a booze stash. Ugh. Still smells like there's something in there. Whoa, another bottle. Yeah, watch. Oh boy, look at this. Look at this. What's that? Someone's watch. <laughs> It's like one of those old, uh, like a fob or fob watch. That's why you have fob pockets. That's what that's for. That's your fob right there. Fob pocket. Fuck, I wonder if that work. I'm going to put that right in my pocket. My fob pocket. Here. Right in my fob. That ever cool. Wonder. I wonder what that's made of. I'm going to metal detect it. We'll see if it comes up. Supposed to be like 20, because uh, it might be silver. Are you filming? Yep. Let's just see what comes up. It's coming up at 20. Take a look, 20. That's silver, dude. Yep. That's silver for sure. It looks like it's kind of been in there a while, though. I don't dare wind it up. Is that ever a cool find? Unreal. I wonder what these are. Here, let's check those. 20 as well. They're both silver. Those are those are silver hits, man. Those are silver tea set. Silver fob. I wonder what else is down there. We'll have to come back. We need lights. We need uh, better cameras. More batteries. Unreal. What a great find. Okay, let's get out of here. It's starting to get dark. Yeah. Yeah.